So it's been quite a long time since I've played this game. Um, I've been slowly getting the achievements and P ranks and whatnot. So I felt like playing it. It's been a while. I do like this game quite a bit. So I'm gonna make my best attempt to get something. Not sure what it'll be. But yeah, the game is, is a lot of fun. Um, I guess I'll have to remember what I'm up to. I'll also get re-acclimated to the controls. Hang on. Okay. And I'm, I'm dicking around a lot with this, but like, <laughs> where is it? Game, speed run timer on, I gotta have that, right? Um, and then, cause the bindings are weird when I use the Super Nintendo controller. So I want that to be punch and then was taunt. That to be that. Hold on, but then I've got multiple. Oh, I see, I gotta do this. Okay. This makes sense. So then I want this to be punch and this to be taunt. There we go. Just, that's better. Very minor, but it's just making on X and that Y. Okay, that feels more natural to me. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm not that far into the P rank, so I'll find I'll find where I need to be. Yeah, okay, so I am here. I'm in this world. Uh, I need to find the achievements place. That's got P. There we go. So that, that's probably the next stage I'm attempting. I just want to see what the achievements are for it in advance. That goes up. Oh, no, here. Okay. Um, cool. So, Fun Farm and Waste Yard. I think that's Waste Yard. Avoid getting touched by John Ghost in Waste Yard. Ugh. Okay. And then farm farm is everything. It's complete fun farm while avoiding getting hurt. With mort on you. Find and destroy the mort cube. Kill three unreachable enemies at once. I'll go for the waste yard. The waste yard seems to... I'm not going to say be easier. But it's one. This, is, this should be it. Okay, so it says avoid getting kit. Which, all right, for the first part, well, a particular enemy. So this is going to be casual to begin with. <laughs> yeah, that thing. I have to avoid getting hit by that thing. Yeah. Nope. Go away. But then I also have to learn the stage. <laughs> nope, go away. I 
hate this already. <laughs> by sheer accident, I'm going to get hit by that thing. Also, this music, though. Revel in the soundtrack of this game. getting hit by hang on who was maybe i'm wrong who's john ghost wait does it john ghost i hope it doesn't mean the actual ghost because there are some parts where you have to use it unless that's the challenge is i have to do the stage without becoming a ghost ever No. Huh. I mean, you have to, so it's, it can't be that. I don't know. How about I just go for don't get hit, period. Like, just avoid damage at all costs. Oh, that... that uh, fuck! This is a game that I would love to get all the achievements in. It's just... It's gonna be tough. Anyway, the smell of beans is gone and in the apartment complex. We'll see how long it takes <laughs> before that's no longer the case. At this rate, I'm going to have to have like a days without incident thing. If it happens again, that might be funny. It's just days without beans incident. Oh, what did I get? Oh, okay, um, as long as it wasn't... I mean, let's just see how it goes. I should probably look up who John Ghost is. That can't be John Ghost. Yeah, see, the only way through is like that. the stage. Hmm. 
Do I need enough? Wait, how do I break through that? What do you mean? Oh, that's what it is. There we go. Okay, I got it. Oh, that's not too bad. Just have to be careful. Oh, okay. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Everything is under control. Already? Peanut, please. <laughs> oh, this thing. There we go. We don't have to. We can't get hit by the ghosts. Got it. Oh, I got. I got dicked. I got dicked so hard. I got dicked so hard. It didn't let me. Okay, now I get it. Alright, so then I don't have to worry until the very end. Let's just get through the stage and let's just, in the escape sequence, don't get touched by the ghost. That's not too bad. At least I can try and learn the stage a bit better now. earlier. Okay, so that's how you got this dude. This looks manageable. It looks maybe deceiving, but this looks manageable. I feel like it's within my capabilities to get the P rank on this. Like, I'm not... 100% convinced I can get them all ultimately, but... I got some of them, I'll be happy. I don't know if that was the right call. 
Ooh, okay, for this part, I'm gonna have to be careful. I think I did the wrong thing. I was meant to go through the cheese grater. That would have allowed me to keep combo. Okay, learning experience. stuff to do. <laughs> yeah, I don't mean practical things, just I was playing this game and I was just slowly getting the achievements and the uh, the good rankings on it. Okay, there we go there. This is so hard! Oh my god. Okay, well... Holy crap, man. I can't get touched by this ghost, alright. Achievement not gonna get... Dude! Oh god. <laughs> it doesn't matter how long this takes, just don't get hit by the guys. Okay, in. Oh! Okay, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Go back. Change rooms, change rooms. No, oh, no. Ah! I thought you could slide under there. Ugh. Fucked up. Okay, well. It is what it is. <laughs> so, wait a minute. This here. Okay, see, I don't have to wait till the last lap to get that. Also, hold on. Oh. No, wait, I'm right. Oh. Well, that's okay. I'm not trying for it now. Right, I know where the secret is. Okay, so what? Is that all three now? I think that's all three now. I just need to know where the secret door is. Wait, chest freezer? What's a chest freezer? This might be like a difference in terminology here. <laughs> I have no idea what that is. Is that just like a small freezer? Plotting out a course in my mind. Hey, go back. Definitely need that. It's a horizontal freezer. Oh, okay. Yeah, I get it. The dimensions don't really mean anything to me because metric system, <laughs> but 
I, as soon as you said horizontal, I know what you're talking about. Hey. Part. Let's get this pepper and then go through here and then okay. Yeah, it gives you enough time All right I'm learning this up. Why do I not have the momentum? There we go. Jeez. Okay, that's one thing I gotta be careful for. Okay, don't get hit by the ghosts. That's all I gotta aim for. Similarly, how many kilos can you get from a slaughtered kangaroo? <laughs> Having never slaughtered a kangaroo myself, I have no idea. It's not the kind of information <laughs> I know of. That's, uh, that's probably something for Google. Funny thing is, I, I guess I was technically around when I went camping and they actually did catch a kangaroo to eat. But I was a kid back then, so I don't know. I don't remember how much meat there was when they did that. That, that's, that's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Okay, just as long as I don't get touched. Oh god. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. <laughs> no touchy. Oh crap. I messed up. I was trying to go through that, and I didn't touch the ghost thing. Man. It's okay. This isn't a waste of time, because I can see the course I need to take. Oh, I think I just realized where the secret door is now. I don't know if I want to go for it, because it's something that's probably risky. In the context of not getting hit. Okay. Um, I mean, I, I'm not interested in collecting everything right now, so let's just get through this. They have a... 
they have an official merch for this game, and they have a t-shirt that I kind of want. <laughs> It's just a, a t-shirt for Pepino's Pizza Place, but it's like... The t-shirt just reminds me of the pizza place that I used to go to that had an almost identical shirt. Maybe I remember it being as almost identical, but it's just... It's so good. Apparently, they're working on an update for this to introduce another character to this, so... That's why I thought about the game. I was thinking about that potential more and more. This part is going to screw me over. Right, okay. It is lenient enough if I don't have enough momentum. Okay. It doesn't matter. <laughs> This is the important part. I just... Oh, are you kidding? I got knocked into it. Ah! Oh. <laughs> I did an attack. Ah, uh, I thought I had enough momentum to just charge through them. Ugh, I should have charged. That's heartbreaking. Jeez, that that move is uh spicy. Oh god. Ooh, that is That is kinda risky, but I guess I have to do it in the interest of the P rank, I gotta get used to it. this. Okay, well. It's alright. One thing I'll give this game credit for is just P-Rank seemed very what's the word? Like intimidating at first. Just listening to what you have to do to get it, but it's not as bad as you would think. There is some wiggle room. And... I mean, the last time I played this, I hadn't played Warrior Land 4, so now I've played Warrior Land 4, and... I can appreciate this game a lot more as... Not that I didn't to begin with, like, love this game. But I appreciate it now even more. Because the escape sequences in Warrior Land 4, they're just... I don't know. They felt a bit flat. They were fine, it's just... I felt like, ultimately, there wasn't really any sense of urgency or anything. Like, you could kind of coast through them and be perfectly fine most of the time. This game, they've done well to make it so everything flows from one room to the next, and it's just so frantic when you... Do the escape sequence. Game reminds you of the late 80s, early 90s. Yeah, the aesthetic is just like straight up morning cartoon. Which is what I love about it. But uh, yeah, that's... It's 
game that draws heavy inspiration from Warrior Land, which is one of my favorite games. Oh, ha ha, there it is, okay. All right, well, I, all right, now I need to learn. It's a really good game. This was one of my favorite games last year, like, for sure. I would have, it would have been great if it had won Best Indie at the Game Awards. It was nominated. to this. Alright, so that's three out of three secrets. That's better. It's okay, I know that there was a top in there. Funny thing is, I think to get P rank, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to not get caught anyway. I can't if I get caught, I can't imagine that I'm gonna be able to keep my combo meter. I think. Oh, ugh. damn it! Oh no, that is yeah, that is a restart. Let's just shake that off. back. Fine. Dude. Okay. No, it didn't work. Alright, for this part, I have to be careful then. That's gonna be difficult, but I'll figure it out. I just gotta be ready to do the, uh, the jump. Top in there. Go back. <laughs> okay, it still works. I really hope that after how well this game was received and the fact that it it was game award worthy. That that wakes Nintendo up and goes, hmm, maybe we should shouldn't have gone like I don't know almost I think it's been 15 years but Wario Land's gotten no love in such a long time yeah I mean it's fine I'm not gonna get P rank on this yet I'm getting used to the course Oh, 
Get in the... Oh, 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 okay. I'm thankful that it stops the, uh... The bar as you go in the door. There are games that are <laughs> not that lenient. And will continue time progression. Okay, I mean... Uh, uh, I think... The stage is reasonable. I think the part that's gonna mess me up is just the ghost catching up to me and resetting my position in the room. But the course itself seems pretty straightforward. At least I think so, anyway. Alright, let's go. more for acclamation than anything else. Uh-oh. Ooh. Don't risk it. Should speed run this. Oh, people, yeah, definitely speed run it. Um, but the game per stage has the concept of a speed run. You have a ranking on how well you do the whole stage. So there's a rank people chase, which is P rank. Damn it. And that's so escaping, grabbing everything, not losing your combo meter once. Well, quote, I mean everything is in the big items, not the little ones. And then just doing the stage as quick as you can, and you have to do a second lap of the escape sequence. Which is what I'm going to go for after I, I get just the stage achievement. You'll see it. It's pretty satisfying. But you can definitely speedrun the whole game. It's not something I'd do because I guess I just don't have that mindset to do speedrunning. Just making a little mistake and then having to reset, I, I think that would wear on me too quickly. But I love watching speedruns and I appreciate the dedication and talent required to do it. There are some games that are just super satisfying to watch and this is probably one of them. One of the earliest ones I remember watching was like a Super Metroid one. Just watching someone do that naturally, man. Just how good you have to be to just get through that game quickly. But for me personally, trying it out, I'm good. <laughs> I'm gonna I'll I'll stick to my lane of like gameplay that I'm either playing a chill game, and it's like chill and cozy vibes, or I'm playing something where I'm being entertaining by getting angry at the game. <laughs> that's, that's my brand. There might be a roguelike or two that I get decent at in terms of gameplay, but like, never at the upper echelon. Oh. It's 
okay. It's just nice to play this game. I want to say that within... Within an hour. I can do this. There's a 101%. Oh, right. They added a new stage. That's what that would be. I forgot that they added a stage for Halloween. I never checked it out. But there's a new stage. That's probably what that is. I was playing The Last of Us, so I unfortunately couldn't squeeze it in. Like, I had the Halloween game last year sorted, so... Maybe I shouldn't go in that stage. <laughs> it's I, it's extra risk. Ugh, it's extra risk. I think I should just aim for this achievement and then worry about going to every bonus stage and whatever. Stop, get off, get off. Didn't I disable super jump with... Hmm, I thought I did. Anyway. much smoother. There's something about the sausage in this game that just... I don't know. It just... It makes me want a pizza. Just the look of it. I'll piss off. There we go. Ugh. pizza toppings. For me, less is more. I've kind of been enjoying just pizzas that have three toppings or less. But my go-to lately has been, there's a pizza place near me that it's just a pepperoni pizza, but they load it with pepperoni. And then they put like this garlic oil on top of it. I don't know what it's made out of. I would assume it's just olive oil and garlic, but they just kind of just lightly brush it over the pizza at the end. So it tastes like uh, like garlic bread, but with pepperoni. Pretty damn good. and sweet corn. Oh. I can't say I've ever had sweet corn. Do love the olives, though. 
Like, there's a mushroom, olive, and ham one that I get sometimes as well. Never had chicken, bacon, ranch. I've had chicken, bacon, not ranch. Ranch is... It exists in Australia. It does. It's just not... Not like how it would be in America. It's like, oh, ranch is preferred in a lot of circumstances. Ranch is good, though. Like, I think I've had chicken, bacon, and um, garlic aioli, which is a similar concept, it's just, it's not ranch. This part gives me anxiety. <laughs> Don't, no touchy, no touchy, no touchy, no touchy, no touchy. No touchy. No touchy. No touchy. <laughs> I did, oh, 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 I did it again. <laughs> I, I did it again. <laughs> oh, I, I, I uh, <laughs> Pepperoni pizza is best. Yeah, I like pepperoni. It's good. Mind you, like, if I go to a proper Italian place, one that does, you know, the wood fire pizza, a margarita, like, with really good cheese and just fresh basil, man, that shit slaps. Like, we're talking artisanal pizza makers. When they do a margarita, man. One of your favorite toppings is a nicely seasoned tomato slice. I, I can see the appeal in that, for sure. I'm weird when it comes to tomato. Like, I can have tomato slices, but they can't be too thick, you know? Like, if I'm getting a burger, for example, and it has a tomato slice in it, if it's something that is too thick, I just think it ruins the ratio. I like thinly sliced. It's just, it's a matter of ratio, I guess. Um, I would never butt out of a, a raw tomato. I don't know. I just, I don't, I, people do that, and I just, I don't know, I don't, I don't see why. That being said, bruschetta, which consists of, like, tomato, and just tomatoes in its purest form, but then, you know, it has the olive oil, the cheese, that is really good. And you have the bread to go with that. That's probably the closest you'll see me to just eating tomato, just in large, a large chunk or whatever. Because the somehow that just works. Yeah, on a piece, I don't know. I can I can understand that. It's just probably not my preference. That's just me. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a texture thing, or maybe it's something from childhood, because that stuff does stick with you. If you don't like something as a kid, you can often end up as an adult still not liking it and not really knowing why. Like, my brother, growing up, didn't- would you believe this, did not like burgers. Like, if we were to go to McDonald's and get a Happy Meal, he would get nuggets. He wouldn't want to have a hamburger. And my parents tried to, like, find a reason why. They were like, okay, well, is it the tomato sauce? And one time he was like, yeah, I don't like tomato sauce. So then they go, okay, well, what if we get it without tomato sauce? Like, no, but then it's still a burger. And my brother was in his mid-twenties the first time he had a burger. Like, one, one day, 
got a photo. He was overseas and just him sitting down and having a burger. I was like, holy shit, hell froze over. But then he would have pasta, like... He didn't like tomato sauce, but then would have past red pasta sauce, which is like... Okay, to be fair, in his defense, there's a difference between ketchup and sauce, right? Like, ketchup is its own thing. I, would, I wouldn't really call that tomato anymore. It's like, it's tomato adjacent. You know? That's the way that I feel about it. But, I guess he, he had pasta sauces. And pizza sauce, like, if you were to get something from, say, Pizza Hut, that's more closer to a ketchup. And we would, so he had it on that. Ketchup is a vegetable smoothie, but it's not. Because it's like, it involves reconstituting it, and it, it, it has a lot of sugar in it. It's like, the way they prepare- it's kind of like ketchup is the Pringles of, uh... Of, like, tomato, you know? So you have potato chips and then you have Pringles. Pringles, they're not really potato chips. They... They do stuff to the potato to then form Pringles. It's the same with ketchup, is like, they do stuff to the tomato... Where it's just- it's reconstituted and... It becomes ketchup. Like if you put a tomato if you put a tomato in a blender, it's not the same as making ketchup. Like you don't have ketchup instantly. Or if you make a smoothie and you just start with tomato, it's not ketchup at that point. That's what I mean. It's it's its own thing. Knowledge is knowing that tomatoes are fruit. Wisdom is not putting fruit in a salad. Oh, man. You know, the funny thing is... What they did in Stardew Valley with Demetrius... And the whole, like, oh, technically it's a fruit thing. I have... I, I know someone that is like that. There are a lot of things that are a fruit. Like, eggplant is a fruit. It's not just tomato. And I'm kind of hankering for, like, the thing that I do f with leftover pizza. If I have leftover pizza, for breakfast, I'll cook an egg in a skillet, however I want it, and then put the pizza in the skillet after, cook, it, cook the bottom of it so it heats up, and then put the egg on top. So it's like, you eat it with a knife and fork, and it's great. It's like bread, meat, cheese, egg. And the bottom of the pizza, if it's not already, well, it's not already crispy, it'll crisp it up a little. It's nice. But breakfast pizza. Don't want to get touched by the ghost. That's all I want right now. Oh god. <laughs> I mean, I'm doing. I'm playing as I should be playing for. <laughs> I almost did it again. Okay, okay, okay.
Good lord. Yeah, don't worry about that. Oh god. This is stressing me out. <laughs> How's this not over? No, Calder! Ghost, please don't catch up. 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 Okay, got it. <laughs> All right, that's the achievement done. There's breakfast pizza, sure, but then there's what I described, which is putting an egg on pizza. There's breakfast pizza? What do they put on a breakfast pizza? I mean, in Australia, you can actually buy pizza where they put, they kind of put egg on it. Not like a whole egg, they drizzle... I guess they're just whisked eggs, but then they just drizzle it on, on that, so then you just ends up with little pieces of egg in the pizza. Typically, it's done like on a ham, bacon, and onion pizza. Okay, now we go for the difficult stuff. Wish me luck. Now I have to be skillful. Can't say I've ever seen a place that offers specifically a breakfast pizza. Stop it. Oh, this part here, this part here. Okay. That worked. So now I'm in the business of keeping combo up. If I lose combo, I have to restart. Dude, oh, I hate it when it does that. Hey. No. Oh, no, I'm still, I'm still okay, still okay. I was just trying to get more points. As long as I don't lose combo. Man, I can't, I can't read for the next few <laughs> couple of minutes. When I'm in an attempt, I have to, like, focus on my attempt. Unfortunately, this is one of these games where, like, chat has to take a little bit of neglecting. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, still, still in it, still in it, still in it, still in it. <laughs> the audacity of a streamer. I can read short sentences. It's just when it's more of more than a little sentence. That's when it's very hard. Don't lose combo. Okay, everything is good. So far, this is actually going okay. For a first real attempt, it's not bad. T hey, Colorin. Okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
Alright, so far so good. Absolutely not. Get away from me. Too much. Oh god. What was that? <laughs> no stress here. No stress here. Oh, oh, ho, 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 ho. Okay, just don't stress too much about this. Nope. Okay, 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 okay. Just repeat, repeat what I just did again. Except this time we're going down this way. Almost messed it up. Sorry, chat. I know I'm neglecting. <laughs> First try. Not even kidding, first try. Alright, that was fine. I took damage once. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Given I haven't played this since August last year, I'm happy with that. It really has been that long. Alright, nice. Um, let me catch up on chat. Um, dude. So, let me scroll up. Wait, so they do a breakfast pizza where sausage gravy is the sauce, scrambled eggs, and then other breakfast foods are toppings. Huh. I don't think I've ever heard of that here. Uh, but yeah. Everything else is just people talking. <laughs> it's okay. Ah, oh, man. All right. Well, let's see. I think it's the chicken stage. So this is just going to be a casual walkthrough now for now. So what are the chef tasks here? Kill three unreachable enemies. Find and destroy the Mort Cube. Complete... Fun farm while avoiding getting hurt with mod on you. I guess that one's like one that I can go for. But for now, I'll just do this casually. Just walk through the stage, it's fine. 
take a mental break. <laughs> I'll... That's gonna be a problem. Okay, well... Did I say family already today? Nah, it's not even midday here. That'll be later for dinner. I kind of woke up wanting to play something, but I wasn't sure what, so I figured, ah, it's been a while since I last touched this. Oh, this is the unreachable enemy. I think the way I get him is combo. Oh, right. <laughs> Eggplant. Okay. Oh, uh, we're going to this Malaysian restaurant. It's pretty good. They do noodles and stuff, and yeah, it's good. There's a secret. Yeah, don't worry about secrets. I'm not really aiming for that right now. But uh, if we could keep the back seating to a minimal, I'd appreciate that. Sorry, I know you're trying to help, but this game tends to have a habit of people saying, Hey, you missed something, streamer! Go back! I'm just going for the part where Mort the Chicken doesn't take damage whilst I have him. So I'm starting with that. Streamer, why you not get everything right away, eh? I thought you were supposed to be good at this game. Did you not get a P rank on your first attempt? What's going on? Why are you playing game like you've only played one game in your entire life, huh? Do they sing to you in restaurants? No. I mean, I'm sure they, they do. I think the... The thing that they'd usually do is if you give them a cake, they'll bring it out. Hey. There we go. Jeez. Yeah, that's gonna be a issue. I don't know, when it comes to places coming out to sing for you, I guess because I've had the experience of working in, I wouldn't say a restaurant, but I guess food in general, it's just, I feel like the staff don't like doing that. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong. It's like, oh, we have to go, we have to go sing. They're making us sing. Management makes us sing. I suppose it depends how much you're getting paid, but. It's not like we're going anywhere super fancy. I'm good, I'd rather they didn't sing. I know there's a secret up there, don't worry. Just not interested in that right now. See the eye. Ugh. 
Oops. Free cake and ice cream? Well, that's not really a thing, then. I can't say I've ever been to a place that gives you free cake and ice cream on your birthday. It's just all... Always a case of they... You bring a cake and you're like, hey, we're here, someone has their birthday. Really? Yeah, it's just not a thing here. Places will bring out a cake if you give it to them, but... For that place to be like, hey, prove it's your birthday, you get a free cake. I can't say I've ever been to one. Or a free scoop. Okay, as long as the chicken doesn't take damage, I'm good. I just don't want to focus on too many things at once, because that's how you don't get anything done. <laughs> Oops. I hate these ladders already. That would be oh, it's alright. Whoops. Alright, as long as chicken doesn't take damage. Does that... Ugh, I mean, does that count as damage? I don't know if that counts as damage. I mean, he does break his leg. I will see if it registers. Ah, oh, yep, that's gone. <laughs> that's definitely gone there. Ah, uh, eggplants. It had to be the eggplant. It's the one food I can't eat. Just not even by force. It just makes me immediately just have a gag reflex, but then afterwards I, I feel sick. Eggplant palm is so good. I'm sure, like, it's nice. It's just, you know, my stomach doesn't agree. That's, that's all it is. Can't really help it. Oh. Neat. I thought it maybe might be just the way the eggplant was prepared, but I had it without knowing that I, I had eaten eggplant and yeah, same end result, just did not like it, was not feeling good. Try white eggplant, but I guess that's the thing, would you say that if I tried eggplant, that particular eggplant, it would be some- it would be an amazing experience. It would be something that I'd be missing out if I didn't. Or is it just like, a, oh, you know, it's good. But you wouldn't put it in, like, your top tier of food all time in terms of food. Because if that's the case, like, I don't want to roll the dice. It's... I, white eggplant could very well be fine, but there's also a chance I could have the same reaction. And in that case, it's just like, well, I'm in for suffering. And if the food is just kind of average, I don't think it's worth risking that. At least not in my eyes, you know? So if there's a chance that you are going to be sick by trying it, would you roll the dice on eggplant or white eggplant? I don't think I would. It would have to be like an experience that changes my my views on food, you know? 
Like, seeing colours I, I have never seen before. No, but you always try new things. But I guess that's the thing. It's not that new of a thing. I've tried eggplant. And that's the that's the problem, is it's a thing that I've already had a bad experience with. So it's not that I'm inverse to a new thing, it's more that I'm trying to find a way to enjoy something that I don't enjoy. <laughs> Damn it. Exact same thing happened. I, I need to pay attention. Ugh. I think when I get up to that part, I'm gonna do the thing and just not look at chat, at least until I'm safe. Much like how I, I did the P rank in one try, I was like, oh, I had to just focus and be a little antisocial. Everything before that point is fine. It's just I can I can read. There's, there's no sense of urgency. And I guess that's the thing. If I want the palm experience, wouldn't like getting a chicken one? Okay. Even if let's say the white eggplant is something that is manageable for me, right? Then, if there's, on the menu, there's an eggplant palm and there's a chicken palm, I'm always gonna go to the chicken palm. It's like Carol Lamar, you don't like the texture, but you want to try it. And you still end up not liking it. Right, but, I guess the difference here is, the calamari is something that you don't like, whereas in, for me, the eggplant is both, I don't like, and it makes me, it makes me sick. That's the problem. If it didn't make me sick and it was something that I just didn't like, the, 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 I don't know, the purple eggplant, then sure, trying the white one is like, well, what have I got to lose? I don't like it. But this could be a case of like, there's potential results, right? It could be that I don't like it and I get sick, or I like it and I get sick, or I don't like it, but I don't get sick, or I like it and I don't get sick. Three out of the four, it's, like, not good for me. So, it's just... Why? I don't know. The incentive to roll the dice on that one is, is very low. That's what it is. If it didn't make me sick, I think it'd be more, I'd be more willing to, like, try it. If I'm feeling adventurous, I don't think you realize how sick it makes me. <laughs> like, uh, yeah, I just don't feel right, and then... Depending on the quantity of it, like, I just... I feel nauseous, it's just, it's no good. Oops. <laughs> I guess I have to practice that, huh? What? Hang on. Ooh, this is... There we go. Yeah, okay, I mean... Oh, that was a chef toss. All right, cool. Nice. Well, that's... yeah. So it's not required. All right, that's fine. Calamari is one of those things that's just very easy to mess up, and to have good calamari... It's definitely, um more rare. 
white eggplants are traditionally less bitter and acidic than purple eggplants. Yeah, I don't know. That's the thing. It's... There's two things we're trying to solve. There's a flavor thing, and then there's a, well, what it does to my stomach thing. <laughs> That's... I don't know. The three times I've tried it, it's just... Each time I've had a bad time. I don't think it's acidic, because there's other foods that I've had that are probably as acidic, if not more so, and I'm fine with them. I- I don't know. It's not one of these things that I'm gonna really be too adventurous on. No, oh, it's not that. Do I see the salty chip challenge? No. What are, what are people subjecting to themselves? What are people subje subjecting themselves to now? <laughs> oh, damn it. I thought I could smack it. It's a very salty chip. Okay. I mean... I bet there's going to be people out there that find that just fine. And they're very much into their salt. I know a few people like that. Is it one of these things where they're charging like a premium to do it? You gotta love it. It's streamer bait. Oh boy. Um. All right. Anyway, let's try not to mess up this. <laughs> It's from the maker of the spicy chip one. Oh, I think we looked this up and it was just insanely expensive to import that to Australia. Because they're just not doing it here. Or I think even the ones that you could find that were Australian based were just... Yeah, that, that's a pass. <laughs> Listen, I get excited when I find $3 bags of chip, potato chips. Because I don't want to pay six. The chip is bright green. Yeah. It does. It's one of those things. It's gone above a certain cost threshold. The cost threshold that I always put it in terms of is like, how happy is this going to make me? Well, how entertained am I going to be? And the measure is always like, can I go and get, like, a nice meal from, say, a, a local chicken establishment? <laughs> I think falling in the pit counts. If I can go get food from a local chicken joint and it costs less, then it's just... I don't know. I have a harder time justifying it. If streaming was something that was like my career, then yeah. I, w I would probably go for it. So just tax deduction. It's like, hey, this I did this for content.
But as it stands right now... Unless it's reasonably priced, which it's not. <laughs> I guess all, that's what it comes down to. It's just, it's not reasonably priced. I don't know, man. I have reservations about doing content where I'm, like, punishing myself. It's a slippery slope, that. I mean, wasn't there a dude that just got recently banned for... Like, even though it was fake, apparently. Just, uh, making it look like... He was electrocuting himself with his toaster. That's that's where it ends ultimately. It's just I don't know. And you just start doing more and more things. It's seventeen ninety nine. Plus shipping, but that's US dollars, right? That's insane. I would not, d yeah. Unless I was a content creator, that's just that's just not worth it to me. Cause, okay, seventeen ninety nine USD to AD. Dude, that's twenty. That's twenty seven dollars. That's without shipping. It'd be thirty dollars with shipping, no doubt. For one chip, nah, uh, I'm good. And again, just, I don't wanna, I don't wanna do things where it's like, how can I phrase this without making it sound like I'm just shitting on people that do this content? Okay, I don't wanna make my stream a place about where it's like laughing at the streamer. You know what I mean? I mean, don't get me wrong, you guys, like... You can laugh at me. There's stuff where I'm, like, incompetent in a game, or, you know, I'm struggling and I'm getting salty, and you're laughing at me, arguably, when that happens. But I'm also laughing as well, right? Like, as frustrated as I'm getting, I'm laughing along with you. We're laughing together. But that sort of thing, like, I'd be writhing in pain, and it's just a chat laughing at the streamer, and I don't know. I just... I don't want that to be a thing. I've been to chats where it's just... It, that is, I guess, the energy is like... There are times where it's just, I don't know, the stream just laughing at the streamer. It's not my kind of energy. I don't want to be a court jester. <laughs> Even though it can be that way sometimes. It's just... Yeah, I don't know. Hopefully I raise that in a way. If you're a content creator and that stuff gets you an audience and views and it's your livelihood, more power to you. But for me... This is just something where I'm playing games, chilling, and just, yeah, talking to people. So, that's like outside of that scope. You would try it on your own time, but... Ugh. I guess that's the thing, it's like, it intrigues me, but it's just the cost of entry, the cost of admission. What you can buy for, for that price is like, I can get... I can invite a bunch of people over and we can have a chicken feast and play games for that price. For the price of me, like, having one potato chips that's super salty. And it's colored green. It's just, I don't know. Do you ever have a 
have a friend in school where, like, they were that friend that you could pay them to do whatever. Like, hey, I'll pay you $10 to eat, eat this, and they would do it. That's more or less what I don't want to become. <laughs> Like, or they, they just actively seek that. I had a friend in school where there was once we went to Burger King and they had run out of fries. So there was, I think, eight of us, right? And we all got meals and they said, well, we can't do fries, but we can give you onion rings. So. We we're like, sure, whatever, that's fine. We got the onion rings, and they were just rancid, man. I don't know if it was the oil that was old or whatever, but they just- they weren't good onion rings. So pretty much all, all of us just didn't eat our onion rings. And our friend at the end was like, Hey, how much will you give me to eat all these onion rings? Because he, he hadn't eaten. He didn't like uh, Burger King. And so- ugh, how much was it? it it wasn't much, it was like a couple a couple of dollars per person. It really wasn't that much. So the dude would have made like 20 bucks tops. And he sat there and tried to eat all all of the onion rings and they were just gnarly, man. And just we had to go back cuz it was during exam period and dude had to like leave the exam cuz he was feeling sick. That's what that's what it did to him. So whenever it comes to these these challenges of like, hey, inflict pain on yourself by eating this, it's just, I just think back to that guy, and it's like, I don't want to be that. It's just, everyone's just laughing at you. But of course, that's just my view on it. Okay. And those, those onion rings really were nasty. I, I, dude, it was a texture thing, a color thing, a taste thing. Just everything. I tried one, and I was like, nah, this this is horrible. Have I uh, seen the teaser for the playable noise? I'm not really keeping up to date with the news on this game. So, no. But that sounds cool, though. <laughs> they added new levels. It might be worth a look. Right now, I just... Something that I'll just play every now and then when I feel like it. It's fine. D didn't take damage. Man, there was someone I used to watch where... I forgot what it started with, but they started doing that kind of content, and by the end of it, I don't know, I just, I couldn't watch it anymore. There was one where... I forgot how much he got paid, but... His thing was... That he just had to drink a lot of milk. It, it might sound simple, but do you know what happens to your stomach when you drink... ...a large quantity of milk? I don't know, man. Like... 
You could hear his reflux noises as he was talking sometimes, and... Yeah. Go, go, go. Okay, no problems that time. As long as I don't... Okay, good. <laughs> that was the stressful part. Hang on, what was that? No? Okay, I thought that was something. Oh, I took... Ah, oh, they hurt me. That's a shame. Uh, on my end, the stream is fine. So, I haven't had anyone else complain about the stream being strange for them. That's probably on your end. Unless I got someone else saying, Hey, Will, stream is broken. Yeah, it's been fine for everyone, so... I, I'm thinking it's like a connection problem. Yeah. Thank you for confirming that it's all good, chat. The only thing I could think when I saw that milk thing was like, this dude's gonna make himself lactose intolerant. That's the crazy thing that I learned is lactose intolerance can be developed by having too much milk. I have a friend who uh, grew up in a country town where that's where they uh, they made flavored milks. They manufactured a lot of flavored milks. And uh, the factory would donate a lot of milk to the school. So, the guy had the flavoured milk practically every day. And I think by the time he got to the end of elementary school, he just started feeling, you know, just... Not sick, but, you know, lactose intolerance, stomach problems, and... Then, yeah, he became lactose intolerant. And it's a thing, it's... You can get it by having too much milk, or you can also get it by having not enough milk. It's just... Man. It's also something that just can happen naturally where your stomach just isn't producing the enzymes, so... It's a, it's a funny thing. Up. I just want to get this achievement, that's all. It's okay, that didn't count because I don't have bird with me. Chicken. Now! <laughs> ah. Good stuff. Nice music, but it's, I think, one of the... I'm not gonna say weaker tracks, but the other tracks, man, there's just such... jams. This one's more of a laid-back one. Here we 
go. I'm still hoping that I get into that program where... Twitch will give access to the new video encoding settings. That'd be so nice. Ah! Oh, the chef task. I thought, I'll go for this one. That seems fine. Oh, dude. Also, I gotta get used to this, is just doing this whole circuit. Just to get the extra... extra points. Uh, let me do this. Because at least this will get my combo up. Okay. I, I know I'm aware I've messed this up. <laughs> I got, okay, I got one. That's the other one I can work on, is just getting the stuff that's off screen technically. <laughs> Need to start thinking about lunch, like what am I gonna eat? Should probably do something small. Go away, potato. <laughs> chicken. I don't know, I've had chicken for the last few meals. Don't you dare. Chicken salad. <laughs> That's still chicken. I might do like a quick pasta or something. I lost, I lost already. Hang on. I know, I get it, I eat a lot of chicken. <laughs> But like, okay, I'm just testing something. I feel like every now and then the D-pad is still doing the jump special, even though I switched it off.
this is what I should be doing. That's what happens when you do it correctly. Ah, uh, it only gets one. I thought I could get all of them. Interesting. That wasn't... it's okay. Still fine. As long as I don't mess this part up. <laughs> oh, I fell. I knew it. As soon as I fell, I was like, oh, I'm going to collide with the size, aren't I? I'm trying to do both, because I think both are achievable within the one run. Okay. Just getting more used to this. Oops. Okay, that still worked. Oh, no, it was off screen. Hurry up. Thank you. Oh, well. Stressing me out. I was like, oh, it's, it's gonna hit me. Okay, everything is fine. I keep thinking the side is gonna boomerang back up. That might be memory of, like, another game just <laughs> doing me dirty. Oh, my God. Okay. There we go. That's another one. I just need one more tomato. I guess I should get used to this, huh? Oh, no. Ah, oh, shit. Um, that counts as damage. I think I'm gonna keep going, anyway. I didn't realize it was that way. Because the tomato thing's gonna happen, so let's just 
keep going. Had the rest for mac of mac and cheese for dinner. Oh yeah, right. I keep forgetting it's the same day for all of you. <laughs> it's just... That's weird. You've seen me twice in one day. For me, it's a whole new day. I honestly, as much as I like summer, the winter time zone is, is just so much better. It's just a better time in terms of streaming. Because then it's not that late. There we go. Alright. Cool. It got saved. Alright, so now we just have to do this. If I stream later tonight, I'll see you twice in one day. Yeah, that's true. But it's not usually the norm, I guess. I guess either way, it's not the norm. So for some reason, this... Maybe because it's just people aren't used to it, but... I've tried doing a few streams at an earlier time, and it just, for some reason, doesn't work. When I say earlier time, I mean, you know, during the day my time. Like, starting maybe two, three hours ago. need to get through this now and then I can start making attempts at this I'm not sure when daylight savings is but it's usually when it's closer to winter if I was to take a guess March or April I'd have to look it up because it moves every year I think it just depends on when the Sunday is March 10. Yeah, so then... Uh, like, mine would be either before or after. Most likely after. So I think it might be April. I'll have to check. Uh, we go back... We go back an hour, and you guys go forward. The easiest way to remember is spring forward. So, if you're experiencing f spring, that means you're going forward an hour. Oh yeah, going towards summer, that's another good way to remember it. Yeah. Yeah, I remember there's, there's like, a couple of weeks where there is an overlap, so that's why I'm thinking it's April. Ugh, damn it. Why does... Ugh, I hate this. <laughs> I keep, that keeps happening. That exact same thing. I need to deal with that better. Because I think, um... The way it works is... When it's spring for uh, when it's spring for when it's when it's spring you start daylight saving sooner compared to when it ends for someone so it would make sense that it's going to happen in, in April I don't know Oops. 
spring forward, fall back. Oh, yeah. I didn't even think about fall. It's just because we use the word autumn here. Instead of fall. That's one thing I'll probably give to the Americans. is like, autumn is such a complicated wor word. Like, yeah, fall is simpler. Granted, if you're learning English, it kind of sucks to have something that means falling over or, like, season. It's, like a, it's confusing when the word is spelt the same and then it, it means something completely different. English is complicated. English is just the result of a... It's meshed with too many languages. That's the problem. Every language has its problems, for sure, but there's just so many. Oh my god, what? Like, I have... Do I have to take this out, but... I can't control the fall. No, there's gotta be an easier way to do that. I keep... That's the part that keeps getting me. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna slow down at that point and pay attention to what I'm doing. Cause I'm gonna have to deal with it if I'm doing P rank stuff. So I'm sure there's a simple solution to it. I just gotta do it. I didn't have to come in here, huh? If I'm doing the chicken thing. <laughs> Wait, can I taunt? Maybe taunting when I have the chicken might be the answer. Assume I can. I'll try it. Get lost. <laughs> you know what? I don't care about that. Let's just... Go for the goal. Oh my god. <laughs> that was admittedly stupid. I mean, I should be proud because I got the P rank on the previous stage first attempt, so it's like, well. As bad as this might be going, at least I did something somewhat impressive. brief moment I was good at the game. I love that the chicken is dragging him along. I 
Like, he has no say in this. <laughs> okay, let's... Please... Please not mess this up. No, you can't taunt. Oh, there it is. All right. All right, all right, all right. I got it. I got it. It's amazing what happens when you pay attention. <laughs> Just get through the rest of the stage. Gone. <sighs> okay, hold on. I just realized. Okay. I had a little bit of my drink left. <laughs> I needed to finish it. I mean, honestly, I don't think this is going to be too bad, you know? If I look at how this stage is operating... A drink? Uh, let's say apple... lemonade. It's good. Good summer drink. Very, uh, crisp. I know I shouldn't be. Oh my god. No. Ugh, damn it. It's okay. I had to get more acclimated to this. You have to do it at the tip of the jump. Okay, for that, I think I have to run through it because otherwise I'm gonna lose it. There we go. Okay, finally. <laughs> it feels like it's been a while since I've been here. I don't know if that's worth the time. I guess well, it doesn't matter. Again, we're not going for like P rank, we're just trying to. Wait, no, that, that, that's fine. It wasn't chicken, it wasn't chicken, it wasn't chicken. 
I panicked. This is fine because it wasn't chicken. As long as I don't lose this when I have chicken. Oh, nope. <laughs> Almost got me. That got me. Damn it, that part. Okay, I was close. I'm getting close. You know, in some ways... This is more annoying than the P rank, because the P rank at least there's leniency. You can take damage and still be fine. This is just, well... Nope. Start again. I think that's kind of funny in the previous stage. It took me longer to get the little achievements than it did to get the actual coveted thing. You know what? Screw it. I do like how chill the music is. That's one thing that can prevent me from getting too salty at like a platformer is if the music is really chill. It does wonders. It's like in Donkey Kong Country, I hate underwater levels, but... Man, the underwater levels in Donkey Kong Country. The music. Well then. <laughs> That's just eggplants. Eggplants are causing me grief. Maybe that might be quicker. on their face as well, I mean, they're not, they're not the smartest of, uh, creatures. Oh, I thought for a sec that hit me. Okay, as long as I don't take damage with chicken. Oops, too early. Let's 
so far, so good. It's gonna come down to that same spot again. Ladder, please. There we go. Okay, don't mess up. Oh, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. As long as I don't take... Okay, good. <laughs> Hopefully there's no more chicken parts and it's just... It's... Yep, okay, cool. There we go. <laughs> okay, chef task done. Now it's time for the real deal. I doubt I can get this first attempt. This one, this stage seems to be like a little bit nightmarish. Mind you, I don't have, okay, I don't have the location of all the rooms yet, so. Okay, I know where that is. Actually, it doesn't seem too bad. Let's just see. You never know. I could be okay. Oops. This will be fine. As long as it keeps it up. Not not great, but still okay. Trying to keep combo. It's a little scary. Oh my god. Okay. That was <laughs> that was bad. fine. Under control. Now I don't have to do the no damage thing as long as I don't lose combo. Gotta take the time to kill him. Lost it. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright, I'm gonna just investigate the rest of the stage. Let's 
it's okay. Don't worry about it. So that's two. I need to find the third one. That's not too bad. Oops. taking the extra time here. Why is that there? It almost leads me to believe that the secret I'm looking for is like up there. Hmm, maybe not. It usually has an eye on it. Oh, there it is. Okay, got it. That's a long one. Okay, and um, I guess I have to plan out how I'm gonna get, uh... Okay, it's something like that. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's a move. <laughs> Definitely a move I have to pull off. Okay. Alright, I think I'm ready for it. I got the gist of it. Now I know where everything is. screwed me over. Okay. This part blows. 
There we go. I lost chicken. It's okay. Should hopefully still be okay. Leniency. I don't ruin this. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Ooh, that is cutting it close. Okay, we're up to it. I don't know about going for this. I don't know if this is a good idea. Like, wouldn't this slow me down ultimately? Maybe it's required for the points. That's all it is. Okay. Get up, get in there. Oh, okay. So far, so good. No, why? I didn't press trigger. Okay, that's mostly everything dealt with. Kill it, please. Thank you. Okay, got, got it off, got it off, got it off. God. Thankfully that's there. Uh... Ah! Damn it. <laughs> damn it, damn it, damn it. I was panicking. I was looking for a something to hit, something to consume. I think I, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm going to save the left side for the second lap. So there's no panic there, it's just get the right- Ah, oh, I probably could have had it. I believe, I can- I can do this, I can do this, I believe. I don't think it's gonna take that many attempts. I got through the worst of it already. It's fine. Around. There we go.
fine. <laughs> Just believe. I'm gonna use it for something, it should be that. Okay, so far so good. chicken. It's alright. Ooh, that was almost not right. Okay. All right, so I've saved it for lap two. Okay, everything is okay. It's not okay. Wait, yes it is, it's fine. I thought I had lost it, but no, it's fine. Ooh, this is gonna be cutting it close, it's fine. Panic this time. Oh, shit. No, I fucked it. Ah, oh. damn it. Ah, <laughs> oh, I could have had it. Okay, I think this will be the attempt. Minor detail I messed up. Ugh, I needed to wait for the chicken. I thought I could just run past it. I, I rushed it. I have to wait for it.
You're supposed to finish clinical and took a 10 hour transfer, so you won't be back until 1 am. Damn. Well, I got dinner later, so. Evening, evening stream is gonna be a bit later. That's why I'm doing stuff now. It was worth it, you went to a steakhouse? What'd you have, man? Yesterday I just devoured a bunch of wings because Australia Day and you know you gotta you gotta have something. Sixty ounce New York strip rare, hell yeah. <laughs> that would have been good. And a baked potato. Oh man. I haven't had lunch yet. <laughs> but I'm probably gonna have something small. It's hard to read in this game without losing combo. I need to keep combo. Oh, see, so, okay, your coworker was like just really enjoying their T bone, huh? I can understand that. <laughs> uh oh, any chicken? I screwed it up. Nope, it's it's still alive. Dream's still alive. Yeah, I mean, okay, if it looks like they're deep throating the, the bone, then... <laughs> Still. Who's just enjoying life? It's fine. That's not gonna save me. Crap. Ugh, I forgot to swing. He's still brand new there, so you're trying not to laugh, and he was also deeply religious. Yeah, but you don't have to tell him the real reason you're laughing. It, like, you can laugh and be like, oh, I think I like how much you're enjoying your steak. Like, that's all you need to say. You're, you're not going to go, I'm sorry, it looks like you're deep throating your steak. There's a way to say it where you can still laugh and, you know, <laughs> not say deep throating a steak. But I got that. Sometimes when you're new somewhere, you don't know just exactly the etiquette. There are some places where it's okay to joke, and then there are others where it's just no jokes allowed, and everything is just superficial small talk, and that's all it ever will be. Hey, chicken! Hey, fatality. Uh, I've been alright. Just kicking back. It's a long weekend for me. It's like a S Australia Day weekend, so... Had a day off yesterday, which was nice. Remembered that I haven't... Uh, really fully completed this game. Uh oh. Salvage? Yeah, no, I need to focus. <laughs> Alright, 
I almost lost it. Come here, chicken. It's okay, it's longest combo meter doesn't drop. Am I going for S? I'm going for P, which is the difficult ones. Like, you gotta not let your combo meter drop. And you have to get all the secrets. Shit. That's, that's the end of it there. I'm not gonna recover in time. I know. I almost had it before, and I messed it up. What controller do I use? Uh, I got n the Super Nintendo controller. The official controller Nintendo release. If you have Nintendo Switch Online, you can buy the controller. But, dude, the D-pad on this, I'm telling you, it's if you're playing these kind of games, it is amazing. That console got the D-pad right. And we keep reinventing the wheel. The Genesis and the Super Nintendo, both of those D-pads are excellent. They're just nice and big, you know? And they just have... Maybe it's just because I'm used to it and it was my childhood. But, I don't know, it just feels right. The Switch Lite has a fantastic D-pad. I haven't tried, but that's good. that's honestly good to hear. Because whatever they do with their next console, I'm hoping they just steer away from the Joy-Con gimmick. It's like, I get it. But it's they did it at the cost of uh, like having a good controller. Such a treat to play Tetris with it. <laughs> That's honestly the test of a good controller. That's when I realized the Pro Controller wasn't that good. Um, Tetris, yeah. Really opened my eyes. I like how the Pro Controller feels, but just the D-pad is not great. And then even the analog sticks, when you compare them to, say, the DualSense, they're just not as good. Or even the Xbox controller. Like, I have all the comparisons. Oh. Ugh, damn it! I should have taunted. Well, I'll tell you what, if they don't use Hall Effect sensors in the new console, I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> it's just... You would think they would learn from their mistake. But if you play these kind of games, any sort of 2D game, can't recommend the, Super, the official Super Nintendo controller more. I had the 8-bit do once, but I don't know. Mine, it might sound weird, but the D-pad got, it felt like it was sticky almost, but it wasn't. And I took good care of them. You know, it's not like I ate and used my controller or whatever. It's just somehow they just got that feeling to them. And the D-pad just does, didn't quite measure up to what, like, the original Super Nintendo controller felt like. It's alright, it's just not the same thing. Okay. 
But yeah, this was this was a good purchase. I don't know if I'd be doing nearly as well in this if it wasn't for this controller. This time, this is the one. The 360 had a bad dead zone. I don't really remember much about that controller. I did have one, but I was using it on PC mainly. It was such a long time ago. Oh, D-pad. No, yeah, no. Definitely agree. I think Xbox controllers still have an annoying D-pad. You can get ones that don't have it and have a more normal one, but they're more expensive. It's one of those things where they chose, like, fan- I wouldn't even say fancy, just... Unique look over... Functionality. I have one of the new gen ones, it's like, it's the same. That's... At least the standard one is the same. There are other models that, um... Shit. Oh, that sucks. There are other models that have, like, a more standard D-pad, and I've heard they're good, but... I'm not gonna pay extra for that. I'm good, I'll, I'll stick to my Super Nintendo controller. The controller, um, if you're going to use it on PC, I wouldn't recommend it. Just based on the experiences I've had with it. It doesn't... There are certain games where it just doesn't work properly. It's like, the, wi the wireless has latency. And it's inconsistent latency. And it's not every game that does it. So that's the experience I've had with it. And, uh, the battery indicator thing, it just flat out doesn't work in Windows. It's like a known issue, then they're just, they've never fixed it. But if you're using it as a controller for your Xbox, yeah, it's, it's like, you know, I'm sure it does what it needs to do. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't mind 8-bit do. It's just, I guess, the experiences I had with the controls that I earned from them, I was disappointed. How they end, how they ultimately ended up. But that's, that's just my experience. I've had people not have the experience I had, so it's like... I guess I just got a bad batch. Oh my god. Maybe it's because I'm older now that just... <laughs> I've got more of an old man brain.
Okay, I... What, what is going on? I'm not even getting past the initial phase. I feel the tactile bump is lackluster. I would say, yeah. Oh, that's another thing. I mean, it's not bad, but yeah, it's... It's definitely something that's noticeable. Whereas in the Super Nintendo controller, I've had it for about the same time as I had those 8-bit do controllers that um started feeling strange. And this this is fine. I think they just made it out of some weird plastic or something, I don't know. Ugh, okay, I, I see what I'm doing wrong. I see what I'm doing wrong. I'm losing momentum at that point, and so I go around the long way, and by then I've lost it. This happens sometimes where you're, like, on the verge of achieving something, and then... I don't know, your brain... <laughs> <laughs> starts to unlearn things for some reason. I'll piss off. Okay, it's still fine. Nah, this is bad already. Oh, salvaged. Dude, Ugh, I can't get the timing right. It's fine, it still works in the end. Alright, I'm gonna pay attention to what I'm doing now. Got, I've got my my flow. I always have problems getting in there. Oh, everything's fine. Get rid of it. Don't want any problems. That may have been a, a big mistake. Oh god! Ah! <sighs> well, I got too focused on what I did. <laughs> Your new handheld has a mating bone that's that. It's just the same scratch as popping bubble wrap. I mean, what kind of buttons are we talking about here? Do they have, like, a tactile feel to them? Okay. I'm getting it. I'm getting it this time. I'm getting it this time. Damn it. 
<laughs> Wait, what's this bad analogy? <laughs> it's like sex for your fingers. I mean, that can be interpreted in um, a very non-innocent way, but I'm not going to do that. You had the right analogy. <laughs> like, you went with just that. It feels satisfying, like when you pop bubble, like bubble wrap, right? Yeah, had it. It's something that we can all understand. Okay, that was neat. Man. Can you, can you imagine if we we're having this conversation out loud and then your co-worker just listens in on it? Just, you're already uncertain about what you can joke about, and then just here's that. It's like, oh man, it's like sex for your fingers. What did you say? Heathen! <laughs> we'll probably die here. Yeah. Uh-oh. Stop. You're with AirPods on. Yeah, and you're also typing. So, it's fine. But I guess... You're typing, but... Can't hear what I'm saying. Man, Lelo would watch me without headphones on. Like, the courage that guy has. <laughs> there were a multitude of times where people were walking by and I was either talking about something or just making a strange noise and he would just have to explain what was going on. You would not do that. Yeah, I wouldn't either. I would not recommend it. Oh, no apologies necessary. Like, I know- I KNOW HOW I AM! Ugh, oh, salvaged. <laughs> I wouldn't even do that. I can't believe I salvaged that. Oh, man. No, too far. Oh my god. All right, we're fine. Still within the realm of okay. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, I don't know if I should go for that, honestly. It's, it seems like, well, we'll see. Okay, the mistake I made here was not waiting for the chicken and just thinking the chicken would just auto-path to me. Oh, no! Is it salvageable? Nah, ah, oh, I just missed it. Damn it. I will get this.
Man, I really want to run into the neighbor again. And just ask them about the beans. So, in total, they've messed up the beans four times. Yesterday was, like, the fourth time. I don't know what you have to be doing <laughs> to do that that often. Okay. I just need to think how to phrase it, like how to ask them what they're cooking. Medica Vals, no worries. Have uh, fun. Okay, go. You'll do them later, never mind. <laughs> All right. Oh god, I've messed this up. Something fierce. That was a bad... That was a bad... Bad move. Okay, no, it's fine. Jeez. I don't know what I was thinking there. It's okay. Uh oh. Well, I guess I can do that in lap two. Assuming it's even necessary. We'll see. So good. Yeah, I'm taunting that. Go, go, go. I've already got it. No need to complicate it. No, oh, 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 God. I almost, I almost beefed it. <laughs> they almost did the same thing I did last time.
Oh god, what now? Oh! Got it. Alright, cool. <laughs> I feel accomplished. <sighs> One short of a hundred. That's cool. <laughs> well... So the last... I think the last thing I need to do for this area is get P rank on this, which I believe is fighting the boss and not taking damage. So, okay. We'll see how we go. It's like a Mega Man fight, so... Just channel childhood. Ah, oh, I messed it up. Ugh, did it accidentally did a ground pound. Which will probably disable that input because I don't think I'll want to do ground pounds here. I like that that's an option now. Good thing it's not a timing thing. As long as I don't take damage. Okay, no. I'm disabling this. Controls. Controller. Oh. So it was on. Alright, now it's off. There we go. I'm just accidentally pressing down. I can't ground pound, and I prefer that. Good. All right, there's no accidental ground pound. fine. Damn it. It's been, it's been a minute. <laughs> I think the last time I would have faced this boss would have been at the start of last year. Whenever this came out. Let's 
part sucks. Can you take a hit? Okay, gotcha. Oh, I don't know why I did that. I thought it might work. Oh, right, it's the same thing, but like in Shadow now. Dude. Oh, my God. <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I bet I can parry them. Just, I probably should have tried to parry them. I was just scared. Hmm. I don't know if that worked. Okay. Let me stress test. Okay, you can. You can. Yeah, it does work. If you time it right, you can negate the damage. That didn't take damage though. I don't want to rely on it though. Like it's just seems like I'm asking for trouble. Oh, I shouldn't have gone under. Idiot. to do that. Okay. Here we go. Flight time's over. I'll get the... Okay, here we go. I was worried there, like I wasn't sure what was going to happen. God. No. Nah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Ugh, the bouncing cow. I got close. I 
got pretty close. I went under. I shouldn't have gone under. Fun fight though. Give me that rank. Okay, that's, that's a good high note. I've got three today, so good. Alright. I am good. <laughs> I am hungry. I'm going to end on a high note. I got three P ranks. I'm happy with that. Not bad, given I haven't played since August last year, so. Alright, well, if you were watching this later on YouTube as a replay, thanks for uh, sticking around to the end and hope you enjoyed. If you do want to support the channel over there, the easiest way to do so is just click the like button, or you can also watch me play other things by clicking one of the videos. It does help out the channel out a lot, so appreciate those that do do that. But... I'll do more of this soon. Like, I'll slowly make my way through these levels and get the P ranks whenever I feel like it. So, you'll see more of this in future. But, we'll see ya next time. Bye, YouTube.